We're getting ready to load up to go to Sharon Race with the World Outlaws. They have a prize for each one of these if you finish a certain spot. We're last in qualifying, so that's not good. Victory lane and, I made the, and I made it to victory lane tonight. Everybody, I'm Ryan Missler. We just had to change a starter. We're getting ready to load up to go to Sharon Race with the World Outlaws. Went to fire it up in the driveway. The starter took a crap, so we switched the starter. It runs. I'm sweaty. It's bright out here. Let's go. made it we signed in got our transponder drew a 95 out of 100 i guess <laughs> to qualify so we're going out in the back for qualifying at least we get some hot laps before we qualify we can practice a little bit the track amber's gonna walk up to the track and show you it's i already showed it oh you already did yep red clay anxious to get out there it's all this stuff these are all the product decals that they give you. I'm just reading over which ones are, uh, which ones we should run or not. They have a prize for each one of these if you finish a certain spot. Yeah, I'll video you one second. Why did that one look a little sketchy? Uh, I don't know. Remote control car butterfly. Yeah. All right. Let her rip. Ooh. Crash. Hey. That's gonna be a head smack all night. I don't think I'll have a problem. Good job, buddy. Give me a thumbs up. Look at me. Thumbs up. <laughs> it's nice to see you in person, finally. <laughs> yes, it's nice to meet you. Yeah, I gotta get a hat. My head's gonna be up. Inner circler. Yeah. He's in our inner circle. We finally came to his track. Yep. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate it. It's awesome. <laughs> Uh, something I 
and last night I tried to get on the radio. No sticks, no objects, no nothing in your hands. Make sure all your crews know that. You guys can use hand signals all you want. Just can't hold anything in your hand. No lights, anything like that. Beach will be 40 laps. Top five will come here to the scales. Top three will go back out to the front straight away for victory lane. We use split scoring. You cross the, you cross the start finish line. Yellow comes out, you're scored that lap. If you did not cross the finish line, you'll go back to the last completed lap. It's all computerized. It's, we, we can't change it, guys. So get, when we're, we're yellow, just get in single file line. We'll get you where we need to go. <clears throat> Starts, double file, side by side. Full center sets the pace. Whatever you set the pace down the back straightaway, that's what we're coming to green at. Front row, you need to be together when you go by that white VP cone in turn four. Restarts will be double or double, double file. Five or less to go in the feature will go single file. Everybody make sure and stay in the tracks of the car in front of you until the leader or the front row goes. Yellow means your wheels aren't turning. If you make contact with a caution card stop, you will be part of the wreck. If you spin to avoid, don't make contact. You will get your spot back. No hitting cars under caution or after the checkered. No crew members on the racetrack. Work area is going to be right out here towards staging, all the way around. Try and keep it over there, guys. If you do something right here and we don't see you, there's a pretty good chance we're going to go green because we don't know you're over here. So try and do everything down there near staging on that end towards turn two. Two laps for flat tire only, just like we always do. Horn. There'll be a horn all night for all the events. For qualifying hot laps, heat races, all that is is a suggestion saying, hey, we need to get rolling. For the feature, when you hear that horn, you have 10 minutes to get through the green cones, it's all the way back there at the end of the wall for staging.
three and four the last lap. And it felt like shit. the first lap felt good. All right, we're in heat three. We start fifth. Kyle Larson's on the pole. Maybe Evan, maybe they said something. Then they were talking on the radio and said something about scales, but it cuts in and out, in and out. So I'm pretty sure they said no scales, but the he races before me said no scales. And the car was a piece of shit. So I, I thought I would set it up. Um, I thought it's, I had a decent slick setup on, but uh, it still wants to skate going into the corner. So. Now we'll make some changes. They we'll go out in the B main. Oh, you're good. I think. I think there's a B main still. We'll see what we can do.
I went to the scales for you, Evan. I warn you every time. But they told me right over the radio and said, no scales. <laughs> well, I'm going to make you go every time. We don't want to pull an Eldora. For the record, I have not forgot a single time since we came here. No. Nah. I do what they tell me over the radio. Well, I, I don't have Evan's the radio. Everybody's going to fire me if I don't go to the scale. I don't have the radio, so I, I just can't. I just drive right through them for Evan. Thank you. Uh, car fell a lot better. You looked a lot better. It was, it was, it was freer through the middle, which is strange, you know, but you can't over tighten a car. So, I'll get rid of my boot. Um, you look like you had something going when you got on the top up here. Yeah, the top was just so thin, so I, I like, I don't need to knock the deck out in the B-Main when I'm at four That's going true. for the lead. That's true. That four off that U tire, and I'm like, go get away from I had one, one down there. So I had a U tire down there, but in three and four. Uh, make a couple changes for the feature, and just happy we made a show. All right, feature lineup. Kyle Larson's on the pole. Ryan transferred out of the B, so he starts 20th. 40 laps.
I didn't beat them. I think no, so. That's fine. Nothing broke. I just I pulled off because of the, it didn't feel like it did before the caution came out. So I don't know if my right rear being an old, you know an older tire if it's you almost it. got clobbered when you pulled in because people were right on your tail. Oh, uh, that's why I went fast. Well, I sure look like you broke when you went fast. You're going and all of a sudden just. Yeah. yeah. It was not. It looked bad. Saved us a spot tonight. He's got a Econo Mod chassis that he owns, and then the, the guy that won the race is here in Victory Lane. He runs his motor, so that's he, he wants me to get in a picture with him in Victory Lane. So make we made it. Happy. Make the kids happy. Made it to then, Victory Lane, and I made it. And I made it to Victory Lane tonight. <laughs> Gentlemen. Happy Sunday morning, everybody. Well, afternoon, early afternoon. It's a toasty one again today. A little warm sitting out here doing these afterthoughts. Uh, front porch afterthoughts. Sharon, Outlaws, those boys are tough. Um, was happy with uh, how we did. First time there, first time racing on that, that red clay from over the east. Um, I thought that stuff was more so in the south, but turns out they got some red clay over there in eastern Ohio. Shows how, how much I get out. But uh, all things considering, happy with, uh, with how we did. And, and uh, we're kind of off there in a heat race, uh, tighten the car up too much. And uh, just wanted to shove the nose when I hit some moisture. So would have liked to make it into the show through the heat, but that didn't happen. So uh, got the car better for the B main, raced our way in, and uh, felt really good in the feature. I was picking off some guys. I was up to 15th, and uh, caution came out. And just after that, that caution, I think my my right rear sealed over or something. It wasn't a new tire, um, but uh, the car just felt a little, a little uh, off there after that restart. So I figured, you know, we're we had start money, so might as well pull in and, and save it and uh, take notes for the next time we go over to Sharon. But yeah, our buddy Tom there saved us a spot over at Sharon. I probably would have never went to Sharon uh, as you know this year if it wasn't for Tom. You know bugging me about it and uh sharon's a nice place it's a it's a very nice facility and uh uh it's a real real good experience so glad i went and uh just gotta say thanks to everybody uh dan mccarran our camera mount worked real good uh so if you guys are interested in getting uh one of his gopro camera mounts uh there's a, a link to his email just shoot him an email and uh let them know that's a beefy stout mount. It's a it's the beefiest mount that I've seen. So it, and it works really good and it's really adjustable. So thanks for Dan for uh, letting us use a mount and uh, hit them up if you want one. Uh, thanks to Amber and Christian and uh, uh, Dave and Evan. You know, racing two days, racing two nights a weekend, you know, like that is it. It's. Uh, it's really uh, strenuous to get the. It's a lot of work, and uh, I couldn't do it without, you know, Dave and Evan and, and my wife and everybody that's that's helping. You know, it's 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 tough. So um, I had a 
a lot of people come up last night and uh, a lot of first time faces um, saying thanks for coming over their way to to race and uh, they bought some merchandise and bought some of our new hats link below to the website we got got our hats on there got limited sizes in our, all our t-shirts you know those are selling really good so thanks everybody who's gone and, and bought t-shirts and hats and everything on the site and thanks everybody who bought merch last night at the track and uh, a guy came up and and wanted us to go to Aries tonight uh, to race with the outlaws and I'm like man we gotta we gotta work Monday morning you know so we gotta get this thing cleaned up today and get ready for next weekend so it's it's uh, I'd like to race more um, but it's like I said it's a it's a priority thing it's a help thing it's a uh, we got a family and uh, can't just be be out racing all the time and, um, and we got a business to, to take care of too we got customers there too so you know it's it's uh, a life racing work balance and we're trying to do the best set that we can so thanks everybody share this video with your racing friends um, we're uh, we're our subscribers are climbing you know, it's a goal of mine by the end of the this racing season to get up past 10,000 subscribers and hit that mark. That would be a huge accomplishment for us and our our little race team and, and our little YouTube channel here. So, uh, couldn't do it without all you guys. So, really appreciative. Thanks a lot for coming back every week and every video that you watch. Um, give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment below what you think. And appreciate each and every one of you. Thanks, everybody. See ya.